Hey guys, it's JJ Simmer, and right now we are filming. Wait, what? That was the worst intro I've ever done. Okay, <laughs> can I try that again? Hey. This is my May 2018 current household part two. Why am I a mess, guys? Ugh, I like don't even mean to be a mess. It's just I'm not actually a mess. But this is my May current household part two, and in this part, as I promised in the last part, we're gonna have a wedding. She's getting married, and in my mind, this wedding is like super rushed. Like it's a very rushed type of thing. Because I she's had she, just in case you know, this is my sim, I'm Elise. She's already had two kids, two kids with a vampire, and those kids were out of wedlock, and one of them she was dating someone, so they were like, it was like a sticky situation. So this wedding, she's like, she's pregnant right now. Let's look. She's pregnant right now, very pregnant, kind of worried she's going to pop at the wedding, but <laughs> for the third time, she's pregnant right now, she's engaged, and I think she's kind of like, okay, let's try for once to do things right in my life, so she's trying to be, like, traditional, and, like, also, I think that her fiancé, Corey, would like to have a wedding, because after he was betrayed by thinking Nicholas was his son, son when it was actually Caleb's son, if you didn't see my last part of my current household, then you will not get that, but, backstory, I just think she's trying to do this for herself and for Caleb, so we are gonna start planning the wedding, I'm really worried, guys, that she is gonna what is that oh that's a stair hook i was really scared though but i'm super worried that she's gonna pop but let's hope not i dress everyone up for a wedding because i'm so prepared guys you'd be so excited i tried to film this part earlier but my computer is being a little weird i'm kind of worried it's gonna break but let's hope it works and we're gonna take so many screenshots for some reason i'm really like excited about this because she's like my main sim and she's getting married and even though i see this as a shotgun wedding it's exciting and her whole family's gonna come and then her i want to cough Ooh conceal don't feel don't let it show that's what you have to sing whenever you need a cough guys tip of the day so we are gonna have a wedding and we'll have a weenie roast because that's wedding we're gonna have a wedding and we will have this wedding the groom it already knows who the bride and groom is so we're fine and then who are we gonna invite to our wedding um let's just get the household out of the way right our six person household are you serious <laughs> oh that's so annoying okay our household I think this is Corey's father. What is Corey's last name? I think this is Corey's father. We'll invite our brother. We'll invite Annika, our sister-in-law. We'll invite Deja because she is Veer's wife. And Veer is like our... I feel like Veer is like her bridesmaid. Do we invite our father? Mm, I don't know. We'll invite Owen because that's Deja's boyfriend. Should we invite... We don't mind Lilith. We'll invite Lilith. Should we invite Jennifer? Hmm. Huh. That's kind of weird if we invite Jennifer and Mazama Vlator, even though Caleb is coming. I I feel like she won't invite her father. I just don't think she would do that. So we will invite these people. Do we want a caterer? Hire a role. Sure, we'll hire a caterer. We'll hire a mixologist. I don't care. She doesn't really need a mixologist like she's pregnant, but we'll hire one. And then we'll have this. I think the lot I was thinking of was in Oasis Springs. It's called Wedding Tent. I haven't been there recently, so let's hope it's, like, not crappy. Fingers crossed, right? What if we can't go there? Oh, I'm going to be so mad if I can't go there. I think I should be able to. We'll probably just need to go. Mm. Fun. Wait. Why is that not in there, guys? Does it have to be, like, I don't get how this whole thing works, like, where they choose where to go. It shouldn't take just, like, oh, oh, wait, I wasn't reading, I was reading, like, the top thing, guys, so maybe I missed it. I was, I was reading the blue, and I was like, why are there so many bars? I'm pretty dumb, I guess. Uh, I don't think it's gonna be here. For some reason, I just, I have a bad feeling, guys. Ooh, I have a bad feeling. Maybe I wasn't reading the, I don't know what I was reading, guys. I'm, like, way too lazy, too, to, like, figure out what's going on. So, if it's not here, we'll just get married here. Is this the place? This is in Mashuno Meadows. Yeah, guys, we're just going to get married there. I know, pretty basic. But I had a wedding venue, so it's not working. So, we're getting married there. And I will cut back to you guys when we're there. Okay, guys, they're all at the wedding, and they're all dressed in black, which is not okay. This is, like, unacceptable. So, since we're going to hold some traditions, guys, and this is going to be kind of like the bridal party room. So, I feel like who's in the bridal party is these guys. Her daughter. I guess her son, too, would be in the bridal party. And then, he, why is he sad? One sec, guys. Why is he sad? Um, Tired of words. Oh, from learning to talk. Caleb is kind of like, I think, 
I don't know if she'd really invite Caleb, if I'm being honest with you. I just feel like he kind of showed up. So Caleb is going to sit there. You know what? Maybe Caleb and Veer will have a talk. No, his name is not Veer. Maybe Caleb and... What's his name? Corey will have, like, a little talk. I feel like they would have a talk. And Corey would be like, what you've been doing with my girlfriend is not cool, man. Oh, let's change you. Because this is not your... W- I gave them all wedding outfits. Maybe I'll change them all once they walk to where they're supposed to. Even though we can't see that. How fun is that? Let's just change them all, though. She will go into her wedding dress once she's up there. Ugh, a pregnant bride. What a cliche. So, oh, there there's her wedding dress Deja can go into her this is not her bridesmaid dress Deja is obviously a bridesmaid so is Veer in like my head <laughs> because Veer is her best friend and so is who else I'm sorry I can't think of uh her daughter is like her, well her maid of honor oh her daughter changed in the right outfit thank goodness someone's listening but where is I feel like Corey even though he's so non con what's the word non-confrontational yeah he looks really good in this suit. I love this suit. It's just so nice. Even though he's very non-confrontational, I think that he would talk to Caleb after he thanks some of his guests for coming because he's also just a really nice guy. So he's going to thank Carter for coming. Thanks for coming. He only needs to thanks one, thank one, and then maybe he'll have drinks. I don't know. I don't want to make drinks. I could get Caleb to make drinks. No. Caleb and Corey need to have a talk and Corey's just going to be like, stay away from her. No, thanks for coming first because he's super passive aggressive, like yours truly. Oh, Veer. Yikes. That's kind of cute, though. They're cute. I, I ship it. I really do ship it. But Caleb just, like, leaves because he's crazy. Ugh, whatever. She's, oh my goodness. I couldn't even see her because everything was just whited out. This is a little much, guys. Have you even thanked anyone for coming like I told you to? She's just going to the washroom because she's pregnant. Her pregnant, her little dress. She'll look at herself in the mirror and be like, damn, I look good. Practice speech. Yeah, I feel like she should have practice speech. Oh, Caleb just ran past her. That's a little awkward. I just feel like it's so awkward that he's even here, you know? And he's just going to be like, stay away from my girlfriend, you know, that type of thing. Um, complain about love life no he will not do that you will be mean and um and s- argue um argue about argue about parenting maybe he'll do that a bit be like you know what you are a terrible parent to your son and i parent him more than you or something like that and then he'll just insult you know because i just feel like he needs to lay the ground before anything serious happens and why are my sims all so upset like who needs their diaper change is it you i think it's nicholas nicholas um who is this dude oh i think this is Corey's dad right is this Corey's dad i don't know where is nicholas okay nicholas is right here deja can you please like attend to this poor like you're just talking to your boyfriend who cares about your boyfriend change this poor dude's diaper um, change diaper. I don't get why she can adopt him as a care dependent since his parents are right there. She's giving herself a speech. Caleb, after you and Veer have a little argument, can you make a group drink just so I don't have to deal with that? Because I just want to get have like a good wedding. Um, make drinks, make drinks for. Oh shit, I can't make drinks for a group, so I'm not gonna do it at all. Or he could just ten bar yeah you can ten bar that's like going to be like his disguise it's like why he's at the wedding is going to ten bar and i think everyone should start getting seated you know i'm going to take autonomy off because they're all just really annoying me with like their autonomy this is a wedding guys no autonomy you're under my control okay delete wait caleb i still want you to go to the bar see that deletes of course that deletes uh ten drinks oh caleb is angry or as i like to say hangry if that interaction deletes so cory cory's also angry which is kind of unfortunate because it's his wedding day so cory's gonna sit there you can sit there you can sit there you can sit there Ugh, nobody changed your diaper are you serious asia you can sit there and she will just continue looking in the mirror and looking cute um yeah that's what i'm gonna do everyone come on go sit there is everyone coming to sit here? I'm just waiting patiently. You know, maybe they should. I don't want them to, like, see each other before the wedding because that's bad luck. And let's be honest, guys. They have enough bad luck to last a lifetime. Let's talk to Veer. Because Veer's, like, kind of, like, here waiting for us to talk to him. So we'll thank him for coming. Tell a story about ducks. 
I feel like she'd just be so, like, uninterested in everything that was going on right now. Like, she'd just be like, I just want to talk to my bestie beer. I don't know why my sims always seem to kiss each other's cheeks. I think it's like a friendly interaction. Maybe she should take a picture with beer. This is a happy day after all. Maybe she'll want to remember it. But just a picture with beer. Everyone else is irrelevant, right? <laughs> Um, take a picture with Veer, and then she she has to talk to Caleb. Like I think she knows that he's here. He's not a part of the wedding party, but she knows like he's lurking, so she'll talk to him. Oh my goodness, Annika looks so good, guys, and she'll thank him for coming because I think in her mind she did invite him. But look at Annika, what a bang, what a bang! I don't even know what that meant. And she'll what else would she do? Like what would you do if your ex came to your wedding? You'd be nice. You would uh, no. Um, ask about day, deep conversation, they'll like reminisce about their past and they'll be like, sorry this couldn't be us, but I still love you and adore you and stuff like that. Just cute things and brighten day because this is probably a pretty hard day for him because less than like a week ago they were honestly in love. So this is really awkward. Is everyone sitting in their chairs? Yes. Everyone is sitting in their chairs, except for Deja, who cannot follow instructions for the life of me. Can you at least change your child's diaper? Because this is this is a little much for me. Um, change diaper and sit down. This is, like, not okay. Everyone looks really cute. Maybe the bridesmaids should take a picture together, actually. I wouldn't mind that. So, I just want pictures, guys. And I don't want to take them. I want my sims to take them, if that makes any sense to you which it probably doesn't and we need to hurry up because knowing my luck we won't have this wedding in time she'll take a picture with owen too but she'll also take a picture with uh what's her name who's emily's daughter oh you can't take a picture with kids i forgot about that sp small tidbit what did i just say okay so she oh everyone's having drinks that's good everyone's eating oh my goodness did you see her eyes there guys that was so creepy um, but let's just take a picture with Veer, because Veer is our best friend, best man, best whatever. Just He's just the best, guys. And they gotta take a cute picture, and she talked to what's-his-face, so that's all that matters. Caleb knows what's up. Caleb, you can go sit here. She's gonna get married, guys. Oh my goodness. I don't love this. I do. I do love this. But I do. She'll start playing the piano first. I don't know why, but just because I don't want to start this until... Deja takes all of her pictures because if my wedding gets interrupted by pictures someone's gonna ha there's gonna be hell to pay you know I wish my sims would just listen and sit in their seats you know because Nicholas just got out of his seat and I told him to sit in his seat so Harvey go sit in your seat sit Nicholas go sit in your seat sit oh we're taking pictures guys because we oh that's such a cute background oh I love that Oh, and there's sparklers in the background. I always forget about those, but those are, that's like a cute addition. I, I approve. Okay, let's exit. I always have to exit on my pictures. Don't ask me why, because I don't really know why, but it's just kind of like a thing. Oh, uh, Nicholas is like not in a great mood, which is kind of ironic, because you'd think Nicholas would be kind of happy, because, like, because I, I see Corey as his parent, even though he's not technically. I really do. So I feel like he'd be happy, but I guess not. Uh, has she taken all of her pictures, Deja? Like, Deja. Deja is getting on my nerves today. Okay, everyone's getting on my nerves today because I just can't do weddings in real life or in The Sims. <laughs> She's walking over. Oh, they're like walking over together. Oh, uh, if only they were in sync. Story of their lives, right? They're not in sync. I don't hate this wedding dress. I'll be honest, this was like a shotgun red wedding, right? So she didn't spend a lot of time looking for it, but I don't hate it on her. And I think it's appropriate consider considering the fact that she is single I mean not single pregnant like you don't want her to have like this floozy wedding dress that's or short wedding dress those are pretty floozy too um but where is Corey okay Corey is right here so Corey will she'll elope immediately with Corey Corey why would you elope um I want them to do something romantic I didn't want them to see each other before the wedding because I'm very superstitious apparently. Um, okay, guys, let's calm down. So we are gonna go <laughs> here. Um, get married to Corey. Yes, we're gonna do that. Oh, Annika's like playing with her grandson, and that's so cute because Annika hates kids. But the fact that she's putting her feelings aside, to, but she's in my picture, so it's not that cute anymore. Deja. Do me a favor, doll, and light wedding battery thingy, and then sit down. Like I've told you to legit six times. 
see what I'm telling you guys this is a real rush wedding like but let's at least oh we did not get wedding cake didn't think of that are you serious sims like oh are you serious I feel like my sims are just never cooperating okay there we go doesn't this look cool guys she's like she does not look impressed about that he's like so excited you know and she's just kind of like you can see her stomach her stomach is huge oh my goodness she's kind of like Ugh. tradition tradition she's like the least traditional person she didn't even invite her father to a wedding like that's how untraditional she is guys was that their like wedding kiss oh they're i don't even know what's going on you guys do you know what's going on they're kissing each other's hands deja's just in the background lighting shit up it's like cute-ish right aw uh, this is not cute what is happening aw there i took a picture <laughs> are they done oh she's she's having some cramps if she goes into labor right now i will die she does not look like impressed about this whole thing aw there he's putting a ring on her i wish sims actually got rings do you feel like i feel like i should put a ring on her just because oh they're wedding i mean <laughs> they're wedding oh my goodness they're married they're so cute this is a good background too i'm loving it this is gonna go because i have a sims instagram for this specific family and this is definitely gonna go on that so st ooh, woo <laughs> so stay tuned for that guys uh, her pregnant belly legit just left when they hugged. That was a little, you know, they got married. So isn't my goal? Woo, my goal. So it says, you're married. Sims move in together by using the split and merge button. The household, they're already living together because they don't care about tradition. Oh, she's hungry and she needs to pee a lot. This is unfortunate. I would make her happy, but I feel like that's just not what I'm about. Is everyone just going to look at these fireworks? How about you go to like to the washroom i think for you that's the best it solution because you she's also going to pass out this is just not her day which is ironic because it actually is her day and someone should cook a cake deja cook a cake because i didn't think that through weddings meh. i feel like they have to woohoo in the observatory because it's like why well, have a wedding here if that's not going to happen that's just how i feel i don't know if you guys feel the same way uh, <laughs> that's the best wedding cake I've ever heard of. We're not cooking that hamburger cake. I hope you guys know that. We are going to cook a uh, white cake because that's kind of wedding-ish. Wedding-esque. Uh, she just needs to go to the washroom, then the wahoo in the observatory, and then she'll pass out. Just kind of she'll eat some wedding cake because it should be done by then. Even though she's already pregnant, so who needs the woohoo at this point, right? The risk is already taken. See, she even wants it. <laughs> Uh, what if I clicked on the wrong sim? How funny would that be? This is her first marriage, guys. It seems weird because she has two kids, but this is her first marriage, and I'm super excited. This might be the first wedding, too, I've, like, had for this family. Yeah, I think it is, because I don't think... Ooh, are, are what's-your-faces? Parents, John's parents, even married? I think they are. Hmm, I would assume that they'd be married, but they definitely didn't have a wedding. So this is the first wedding of the LP. See... Thank you. You are. Thank you, Bailey. Bailey knows what's up. Her and her father are like obedient. Bailey, I don't know what does what should she do. Go look at. Oh, you can't do anything. Talk to your brother. I don't know. Why is Caleb still here? I feel like Caleb needs to run into the night. Like I feel like he'd do a Damon Salvatore and just go mad. You know, I think he'd be really angry right now. Let's make him angry. Do you want to make him angry? I want to make him angry. Uh, allure be, be uh, disabled. Is there anything funny? No. We're not doing anything. None of that's funny. I wanted something funny. Ho just, he just needs to get away, you know? Because it was funny when he was here for a while, but now it's just kind of like, uh, he didn't stop the wedding. He just had to watch his ex get married. Pretty freaking depressing, if you ask me. <laughs> are they at least, like, what are they doing? Oh, Annika loves her grandson. Who would have thought, guys? Who would have thought? Deja, call me out. Are you done cooking your cake? Yeah, c call it a meal. What's on top of that cake? Wait, guys, does it have, like, a fun wedding thing? Oh, it does. That's really cute. How did they know it was a wedding cake? Uh, oh, because... Uh, why can't I put away grab serving for... Are you not hungry? Grab serving for your son, sure, whatever. I don't care. Do it. Oof. I'm really ticked that you won't just eat it. 
Grab serving for I told you to grab serving for Harvey, so grab serving for Harvey. Are they gonna woohoo in the observatory? It was just a few weeks ago that we were here woohooing with Caleb. I like still I don't think oh my goodness guys, can I tell you something? I don't think her and Caleb are really done. I guess they will, will be like I think I'll probably put it where like she can't have any more kids because I feel like three is too many. Like she's done with that part of her life, but her and Caleb are nowhere near done in my mind. Like, look how upset he is. He's just here, like, oh my goodness, I hate my sins to do that. But he's just like, what do I do now? Like, it's so weird. And now Corey's, oh, that's so, for some reason, that's just so weird to me, guys. Because now, like, Nicholas, it's going to say, oh, he's in such a bad mood. I don't even care about my kids at this point. It's going to say that Corey is now, oh, it doesn't say stepfather. I thought it'd do that. It doesn't do that? Interesting. What does it say for Corey? Oh, I really thought it would do that. Who's Luna? Oh, right, her his former whatever. I think he had a child with her. We should delete her. She's really irrelevant for this story. Okay, it doesn't say stepchildren, but like they are, and that's just weird. But I think, guys, to end this part off, the whole family. By the whole family, I mean their whole fam. Oh, can she even take a trip since she's pregnant? I don't think she can. I was going to say they're going to take a trip, but she is pregnant as hell, so that is not going to happen. Look at how, like, they just look so guilty right now. Oh, that's so boring. I was definitely going to make them take a trip, but I guess that's not a thing anymore. She's, like, wanting to go back in there. She's like, all oh, the memories I have. That's just so gross that she's with there, in there with Caleb and with Corey, but whatever. She, do she does gross shit all the time like she is not like she looks so innocent and i think at heart she's a good person but she has done some bad things but i think that now that her and cory married she'll probably tame down a little let's see if it says husband now has it loaded spouse that's really cool but now that her and cory married she will tame down a little i hope and she won't be g running off with caleb every chance she got but let's remember guys she still does have that vacation home so, has she changed all that much? I guess not. But I think for now, I'm going to end this current household. I will try to do a current household next month. And if not, I can almost guarantee July. Because July is like my month when I do YouTube shit. Because I have so much time. And if you can't tell by my voice, I'm really excited to just have all that extra time. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I hope that you enjoyed the wedding. Can I just like, it, it's really annoying me that you can't see her for this outro. Okay. <laughs> there we go. My sins are miserable, but it's fine. I hope, but anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed this wedding she was really she's very pretty even though she's pregnant like not that that makes you any less pretty but like bride wears like we would have definitely upped it the like bride stuff if she was not pregnant but she is so we i'm just sorry i'm getting distracted because i want to take a picture with them just before we leave so it can be like oh their wedding picture is on the we'll hang it up somewhere but this was fun right doesn't it look like every time she like clutches her stomach i'm like she's in labor because it's so funny because mc command center lets you know when like elders are gonna die but you have no clue when your pregnant sims are gonna go in labor so she can go into labor anytime and i was really scared that she was gonna do this part but she did not luckily so we just don't know and i guess you guys won't see it but that's what you guys have to look forward to the next time i do one of these um what's it called what are these called guys someone tell me current households we'll have a new baby and caleb will be out of our household and i assume somebody else will be out i don't know who i'm gonna kick out Ugh, i do know i think john will probably be out by the time i do my other current household but we never know because we do love john here on jj simmer but we just don't want eight people in my household and caleb's like always alternating because right now i have nine technically and i did i tell you guys what we we're having i think i did because we went to ultrasound and i think we're having a girl if i'm not mistaken which is super exciting but now i'm actually gonna end this part guys thank you for watching <laughs> that's all i can say really just thank you for watching i had really fun and i love current houses i'm gonna do them more regularly so you can look forward to that but don't forget to comment like or subscribe and i will see you all in my next video so bye guys